thing is pretty bright, isn't it? Wow. I can't see how it looks, though. <laughs> uh, did, your, did your screen dim? Really? Did your screen dim? What? Did your screen dim? Maybe you know how it dims. Oh, maybe it does. Maybe it does. Hey, what's happening, everybody? Good morning. You are live with Dr. Cooper on Instagram. A little spontaneity this morning. I'm going to get in a little workout, uh, doing some Pilates today with the one and only, the one and only, Christina Stewart, owner, proprietor, coach of Body in Motion in Kansas City, Missouri. She's shy, but not really. Uh, so anyway, we're going to get in this little Pilates workout. So here's the message. I got a lot of you out there on this uh, semaglutide medication. You call me, you ask me questions. Hey, what's going to happen if I stop the medicine? What do you think is going to happen? If you don't start training yourself uh, to get, to be healthier, okay? And if you don't start eating right. So the expectation is you stop taking a pill or a shot or whatever it may be, you're going to gain the weight back. Uh, so it's very, very important to incorporate uh, a healthy diet, which is most important is 80% of it, but also the other 20% is exercise. You got to do that. And that's going to, that's the only way, quite frankly, really, to improve your cardiovascular health. You can lose the weight, but if you don't do some kind of physical activity, then you're not gonna be able to maintain. Hey, let's get this party started. Turn it over to the one and only Christina. I'm going in, I'm recording it today, but I'm I'm fighting, I'm battling, I'm coming hard. See you in a minute. All right, let's do it. On your back, which isn't the Woo, Lord, have mercy. Jesus, help me. All right. All right, together toes apart. All right. All right, heels. Your toes apart, palms up towards the ceiling. All right, okay, here we go. All right, so I'm flat on the back now, heels up, toes apart. Uh, you tightened it up a little bit the other day, you see? Yeah. That's all good, I can take it. Let's go eight here. All right, six, seven, eight. Now lift the booty for the hover. Oh, I forgot about that. Just a little hover, just let your hands go under, not a bridge. <laughs> Toes up, ass up, I guess, huh? <laughs> All right, here we go. All the day. Now, what am I doing here when I do this? What, what am I working on? I know I got legs going. So you got your legs going? Four. Uh -huh. All right, so lifting my butt so up off the of the butt, thing. obviously, you're going to activate back chain. Okay. Also, abdominals have to hold those hips right. still in the air. Bring that down. Booty down. Let's change foot position. Parallel. Okay, good. Hips distance apart. All right, good. Shoulder width apart, okay. Hips with, hips with. All right. Hips on up, there's right. a little bit in. All right, here there we go with the ball. Here. Keep that tracking. All right. So the ball's there just to help maintain the, the line up between the ankle, the knee, okay. and the hip. All right, cool. Because you have a tendency to lateral rotate just a little bit. All right, so we got a little, I don't know, balance, agility. Uh, actually, I guess it's probably keeping me a little bit more in line by putting that ball between my knees. Yeah. It helps to activate the inner thighs, which draws up pelvic floor, activates okay. lower abdominals. All right, here we go. That's the science behind that. All right. Woo! Building that a little bit. Mm -hmm. All right. I'm going to talk to people today. I'm not going to complain as much. I'm going to try not to make those damn funny sounds you say I make. <laughs> but, oh, yeah, whatever. All right, bring that down. Right. Let's go toes on, heels up. Toes on, heels up. Uh -huh. okay. So this will activate the entire length of the leg, mostly the front, and getting it more active right now. All right. You're keep the ball there, huh? Keep the heels lifted as you push away. Like okay. You're on your tippy toes. All right. So a little calf work as well. I want to do a little calf raise when we finish the seat. That, that actually was pretty interesting last time. Really? Yeah. Okay. Lift the booty for eight. All right, here we go. Squeeze the ball. Uh, so this will be really tough on those calves, ooh. yeah. Heels are, are flexed, or the feet are flexed, you're working a little bit more on the hammies. Right. You should feel a little stronger here. Ooh. Not really, because I've been, you know, <laughs> pumping my legs here in my last, I don't know how many times I've done this. 15, 16, 16 each. So, one, two, three, that's a lot. Lift the booty for eight. Ah, okay, here we go. Ah. 
I'll tell you what, you've heard me say this, but I'm going to say this for people that are listening. That I would, and I've tried every kind of exercise you can imagine. Hit, Tabata, P90X, Bring it down. all that crazy stuff. We know why, like a similar Okay, well, I got to get rid of the ball, man, right? And I would challenge anybody to try this shit uh, and say that it's not a workout. Most people think it's stretching. It is stretching. Yeah, well, it is stretching. But, but it's also stabilizing. Yeah, that's right. I like it. It's a little stretch, calisthenic spring. Sorry, the aerobics. Ah, boy. Last okay, now this here. one. Woo! Yeah, so you should feel that a little uh, bit more around the tailbone area. Yeah, hips. Yep. Ah. Uh, uh, bring it down. Good. Ah. Uh, all right. Bring it in. Cap in. Yep. So go ahead and push out. Yeah, you can do your calf raises okay. here. I would do them in a couple of different positions. Okay. I'd go parallel. I'd also do the heels together, toes apart. But then, as well, I would do an internal rotation. Okay. Because that way you hit all the heads of that cap. All right. So. Mm -hmm. Woo. That's so that's straight on. Mm -hmm. Toes in. Yep. Ooh. Yeah. Ooh. So those are kind of interesting. Hang with Dr. Cooper, you all. Don't look Pilates here. Body's in motion. You can't see Missouri Chef fit the state line. Best Pilates instructor in the world, Christina Stewart. Let's go. Balls. B O S S. Get up on those toes. Ah, okay. There you go. All right. so. so now I'm doing calf raises, uh, three different positions with my feet. Internal rotation, external rotation, now, and then straight on parallel. Oh boy, that does hit a little bit. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, we used to do those uh, in ballet. Woo, they, were very, mercy. they were quite effective. What they call it, the three hit? Um, no, these are just uh, releves. We're doing releves. Uh, relevate, okay. Ah, relevate. Okay. Ah. We go all the way up on the point. So. All right. All right. Stay right there. All right. We're gonna go legs and straps. All right. Legs and straps. On my back now. Okay. I'm still on my back. Give me a foot. Uh, all right. Mm -hmm. Push. Okay. All right. Hold on. Push right up. All right. Bend the knees for me. Bend my knees. Uh huh. There you go. Okay. So we're gonna push in and out. Forty-five degrees. Use that ring, don't let it go. <laughs> so just a light squeeze on it. That's better. Do two more. And I want you to hold it out there and give me eight squeezes on the ring. Squeeze and release, squeeze and release, squeeze and release. Squeeze and release. So each time you squeeze, I want you to think about bringing that belly button down further towards the performer, letting it support Ooh. the spine. Uh. All right, lift and lower for eight straight legs. Uh. Keep booty glued down. There's a nice hammy stretch Ooh. there, but you got hammies and inner thighs working down. I guess I am making noises, huh? <laughs> uh. I could go get some duct tape. 55 and fly, baby. <laughs> yeah, that's me. Cool. All right, Boss. Move the legs up towards the ceiling. Give me those eight. Squeeze and release. Ugh. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Ooh. Take that. Give me big circles. Back right, to the side. And circle down and around. Good. Keep the hips still. Keep the low back in contact. Try to keep it down. Try to keep it down. Mm -hmm. Focus on those abs. Those palms yep. back up. Mm -hmm. Palms up, yep. So you can help keep your shoulders up. Yeah. Keep that heart open. Yeah. yeah. Just breathe. <laughs> Don't I'll forget to breathe. <sighs> Woo! I'm spinning my ass off now. All right, reverse. Okay, here we go. So push down and open out. Back and around. Yeah, I dare you. I dare anybody on this Instagram. Let's get it. Come on, come on, let's go challenge me. Let's see. Ah. Ooh. All right, hold the legs straight out at 45 degrees. Okay. 
We're going to send the right leg out to the side without moving the left. So you've got to really focus on this flick over here, over here and then opposite. Those legs back out to 45. You're going to slip there. Ooh. Ooh. Ooh, yeah. Up in there. <laughs> so think about the connection between the lower rib and the top of the hip okay. on the leg that you're keeping still. Okay. And also push through the heels. Push like, think about really like the energy flowing through the heels. Okay. So that way you will stabilize the leg just a little bit more. Those, are, those look really easy, but they're actually oh, really no, it's tough. Not, it's not easy. Uh, and one more. I appreciate it on those hips though, because you know that's my... Good. Bend the knees. My oh, weak spot. Let's come on out. Okay. I'm going to drink some water. Alright, drink water. Yeah. Drink some water. Right? Okay. Alright. Alright, what do y'all think so far? Who's that? Y'all should be at work. I'm not doing surgery today. That's the only reason I'm on here with you. What's happening, Mike Harvey? What's going on, brother? Kurt, uh, Tammy Tam, what's up? Uh, Michaela Lenz, how you doing? No surgery today. That's why I'm able to get in a little work. Yay for no surgery. Do a little Pilates today. Uh, body's in motion. motion. Can't sit in Missouri. Let me raise this up just a little bit higher, I think, if I got any more height on it. Uh, Y'all know I don't really care. I'm not, it's not a, I don't, I'm not like The Rock. And I have a cameraman following me around. A woman sure all day. Find yeah. Now I'm good though. We're all good. Getting the game in. Pilates. Hanging with Dr. Cooper. How y'all doing today? Somebody send me. I'm gonna wave at you. Okay. Uh, tell me what you're up to. You should be working. All right. Here we go. Making right. that money. So a little balance work, glute work. We're gonna hinge at the hips for some scooters. Nice okay. light touch here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And we're Lady Liberty. If you like, you can remove the other hand. Find your balance. Then we're going to go out to the side. Alright. And then a tricep. You got four sets. Alright. You got to help me with that first one. Yep. I got to figure out what I'm doing here. I think I'm in the camera, aren't I? Yeah. Oh, yeah, we're good. We got a good shot there. Here we go. Alright. So, light touch. Light touch. Give me a big bend in the standing legs. Okay. So, that, that one's going to get worn out pretty good. Yeah, it is. Back on up the belly, away from the floor. Okay. Mm -hmm. Try to take it off. Yep. And let's grab the weight with your left hand. Yeah. Okay. You're in Lady Liberty each time. Push Ooh. back, lift up. So challenging your balance. Ooh. You feel like you're starting to lose your balance. Move the big toe is where you find the balance. So the standing leg, big toe, press it down. And then we'll take that arm out to the side. Keep the leg moving. Straight arm side raise. It's a crunchy shoulder. Yep. So minimize your range of motion. Either that or you can bring it a little forward. That way it doesn't get quite as much tension. Woo, look at that cut. Coop's got that balance, baby, today. Look at that. All right. I don't know if I've ever done this well, Christine. Here we go. Take a little back. kick back. You're on camera, that's why. Oh, yeah. Showing out. Yeah. Oh, gosh. Belly up and back. Okay. Whoo. here for now. Yeah. Okay. All right. Here we go. All right. A little bend in the knee. Two fingers on. Don't be surprised if this side is different. Maybe a little smart, maybe a little less smart, but I'm on different sides. Okay. Take that with your right hands. All right. Lady Liberty. Lady Liberty. Yeah. <laughs> uh, two. Three. Well, you're fine. You're using your 
travels you are just a little bit, just don't five, take it up so high. Keep it below six, the shoulder level. There you go. Seven. something else hurt. Hey, what's happening, IG? Hanging with Dr. Cooper. I'm going to post this all over the place once I'm done. Get my girl, Ikra, to uh, edit it out. But, hey, I'm here in Kansas City, Missouri, 75th the State Line. With my good friend, trainer, also colleague. I'm a heart surgeon, so when we put hearts to sleep, Christina keeps the body and the heart alive for us. She's a clinical, certified clinical perfusionist. So, got that game going. All right, so bottom line, you can take all the weight loss medicine, pills, whatever you want, but if you don't get your nutrition right and your exercise game right, you can forget it. It's all temporary. You're not, also, you're not uh, building muscle mass, you're losing it. All right, yeah, so what Christina said, if you couldn't hear, if you're not building muscle mass, you're losing it. Another thing I'm gonna say about that is this, very, very important. Losing a lot of weight, you need to focus on strength training and resistance training. Because in fact, not only are you losing fat, you're also losing muscle mass, to uh, Christina's point. So you gotta be focused on everything, everything matters. I'm cheating right now, I'm still no extra <laughs> time to catch my breath. <laughs> but I got an excuse, I'm talking to you. I'm over here waiting for the next torture for you. All right, let's get it in, here we go. Jumping with the arms. All right. So start the video over your heels. I hope y'all can see this okay. Somebody give me a thumbs up if you can. I can't. Let me know what I need to adjust if I need to. Go to the side. All right. So balance, especially when you start to rise up. When you're pushing with the arms, try to resist just using your pecs. See if you can make your arms come from your back, from where your left. Okay. So stay down for the first set. Okay. Moving on the arms now a little bit. Still, but everything in this, I think the one thing I've been impressed with in the last, I don't know how long I've been doing this now, Christina, over a year, year and a half, year and a half is the engagement of the core on every exercise. And quite frankly, up for that. every exercise, you don't really, you can't really forget any part of your body <laughs> because it's motion, you're moving dynamic. It's not isolated uh, biceps in the weight room. Those are important too, no doubt about it. But if you want to integrate, you got to coordinate and you got to levitate. <laughs> now, hey, you know, interestingly, to that point, uh, I start feeling that in the upper ass. I was going up over my head. Mm -hmm. I guess I'm doing it right, huh? Because you started to uh, poke the ribs out a little bit, and whenever you draw the ribs back in, the upper ass has to bring those down. And really, the only way to do this is tighten up your butt cheeks. That's, all, that's not the only way, but I just noticed that. <laughs> Staying tight. Uh, it's important. Uh, One more. Yeah, getting it in. Good. Wednesday morning live. KC Mo, bodies in motion. All right, what's next? All right. I'm good, I'm good, I'm good. I took a little extra break there a minute ago. It's all on the peeps. All right. Let me see what you all say about my camera angle. All right, nobody said anything. As y'all sneaking at work. All right. Good. Good. We can see that corner over there. Yeah, so we're good. Okay. All right, cool. Let's do some bear holds. So yeah. lift and lower. You know, plopping. That's your first set. Then let's come on out to our plank. We're going to do a nice combo here. Think about spinning the arms open so that you keep the shoulder blades from popping out of their joint. Okay, so we're going to do a jackrabbit back to plank. 
bring the shoulders over the wrist. Give me a push up and fold. Show it to you again. Plank. Jack rabbit. Shoulders. And we fold. That's my second move, right? My first move is just, just up with the pulse knees. Ups. Bear holds. Yep. Bear right. holds are great. They're kind of better than a plank, I think. So you use a little bit more of your abs. You don't okay. have so much of your body out in a long position where you have to uh, worry about hurting your back. Okay. So lift and lower. All the way down. Reset. Back up. Got to keep the carriage still. Uh huh. Woo! If you're in the gym, don't know what to do. These are great. Just lift and lower your knees. Woo! All right. So. All right. Plank. We're going out to plank. All right, y'all. Yeah, so spin what, those arms. So spin those. What kick it for me? All right. Okay, do, plank. Do a jackrabbit. Knees come in. Shoot them back out. Give me that push up. And then fold at the waist. Back in the elbow. Ooh. Yeah. Out to plank. Jackrabbit. Push up and fold. Try this at home if you want to. The fold and incorporates the abs in the Ooh, big Yes, big it way. does. <clears throat> What's happening, family? How we doing today? Getting it in? A lot of these today, you saw me running last week. Uh, mix it up. Take the stress off any one part of my body. Uh, at 55, that's important. Uh, but I know I look like I'm 35. You don't have to say it, but it's cool. I already know. And the great part of Pilates, though, there's not a lot of uh, high impact. All right. All right. Oh, you know I struggle with these. No, I don't. I don't struggle with these. One, two, three, four, five, that. six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay. And then we're going to do cross body with the skate. Other side. Okay. All right. All right. I'm locking in here. All right. Thank you for that. Mm -hmm. Okay. First move. <laughs> Straight legs. Palms are facing forward, you got the carriage. You're gonna shoot those arms out. Shoot them out to the sides. And again, for your shoulder, you keep them in front of you a little bit, not so much behind you. Yep, so you're on up and in. Yeah. Woo! Posture is very important here too. So think about lifting the, the sternum up as you shift that weight out and then wrap the lower ridge with the abs. Woo! All right. Let's bend both legs. Ooh. You're going to do a tricep pushback here. All right, one out. Mm -hmm. So big squat to bigger squat. Bend, keep both legs bent. There it is. Woo. Six. I'm trimming like crazy. <laughs> Now we do the skater. If both legs start straight, you're going to extend the one on the okay. carriage and do your cross body. Right. So keep both legs bent when you come back in. Shift that weight over and then straighten it. Good.
You cannot break it. Oh. All right. Mm, I can scoot it this way. Oh, yeah, you're good. You can do it. I'll just, I'll just do this. I can't see because of that light. So yeah, we're good. It's all the All right. There. All right, cool. Okay. So Christina, what is this machine? Tell everybody what this machine is. This is the chair. The chair. The body's chair. It looks like a guillotine. Looks like a guillotine. But it's okay. not. It's spring loaded with the with the step here, some handlebars. We're gonna we're gonna work it um, full body. Obviously, we're always full body. Okay. So um, do a little levitation here. So gotta keep that core nice and solid as you so lift core yourself and arms. up. Uh -huh. it so it's basically kind of like a a pull up. Okay. Modified. Okay. Let's do it. All right. Sit my butt down first. So, um, come. Lock in. Yeah, there you go. That's right. Levitate. See if you can release all the way down. Release that. Woo. Yeah. So you're really drawing the core up as you pull. Yeah, that's okay. I know I was sliding off a little too. Ooh, yeah, much better. Oh, yeah. If you want to, you can give me a little flare when you're out there, when you pull up, yeah. Woo! Creates a little, ah. little extra. <laughs> ah. All right, you're done. Yep, yeah. Oh! Woo! Mercy. All right. All right. A bit Back. more arm work. Okay. Not. What's happening, team? Cool, hanging with Dr. Cooper. Get a little Pilates in today. Just brought y'all into the lab in case you wanted a few tips, trips, and a little bit of motivation. Again, right. we'll start in that crouching position. We're okay. gonna bring the arms up and bring the hips forward. Crouching tiger, but the dragon's not here. <laughs> Serve right. up your dinner. Okay. So bring those hips forward, then we'll go out to your side and keep it in your peripheral vision. Okay. And we'll also do salute. Okay. Four up every time. Four up every time. All right. I want to thank you all for hanging with Dr. Cooper once again. Appreciate you. Hey, go check out my podcast on my Apple you know, and uh, Spotify. Four things. Like, subscribe, download, share. Like, subscribe, download, share. Okay. Uh, Talk to me about the springs that you get in there. I'm good. I'm good. Okay. Too much? No, it's good. Okay. Woo! And then it's all the way forward. Get the hips right on top of the knees. Good. When you get up there, squeeze the booty, tighten the belly. Uh -huh. Each time. Squeeze, squeeze. Okay. Now towards the tree hug. Additional arms. Yep. This is in feeling this in my two. Three. Come on, team, let's do it. Four. Five. Six. Ooh. Seven. Ooh. Eight. Woo! Oh my goodness. Mmm. Mmm. So if you notice this sequence for most of these is 24 reps although we just changed the motions a little bit but we love this one. try that on for size <laughs> all right we do things in threes it's like feng shui of flights so hips over knees oh yeah here we go we got first we got pulls each side and then we're going to do that modified um, cat cow so you'll pull in, round up, 
and release just for you because you like to have a little bit of uh, okay, extension. Yeah, yeah, so just come back into your neutral. So don't go all the way into it. Okay. Oh, by the way, I would love to do that. What? Today, since I'm here. That little, my little arch machine. Oh, over you there. want to do that again? Yeah. yeah we'll finish with that. All right. Okay, so. Mm -hmm. Open up the chest just a little bit. Yeah. Not the chest. The chest. Yes. Open the chest. Okay. Or open. How about you? There it is. That's better. Okay, go. All core. Yep. <laughs> a little bit of triceps too. Yeah. Whew. And we'll stack hands on one side to take the obliques. Good. Stabilizing the hips and over the knees. That's the lower abdominals, keeping all that under control back there. No, no, I would side this. Ooh. Alright. Alright. Ah. I'm sweating now. Alright. Alright. What happened, Dream Team? Cool. Doing some Pilates. Taking a little break with my coach. The best Pilates instructor in the world. Christina Stewart. Bodies in motion. 75th and state line in Kansas City, Missouri. No surgery today. So I took this opportunity get in a little Pilates, and a little variety. Spicy in your life. Uh, I do everything. Go to the gym, run a little bit, not as much as I, I used to. Uh, Pilates, get ready to start doing a little Tai Chi. Yeah. Hey, y'all like that, don't you? Uh-huh. Yeah, switch it up a little bit. Experience everything, that's all the tough. Don't get locked into any. Routines. Okay. It's not simpler than that. Okay. All right, here we go. Now, I like this. This is a nice low back stretch. So go there. Go on back. Christina's yep. got the nice arc barrel on the table, if you can see it. Uh, I've been doing this for a year and a half. She never brought the thing out until last week. Oh, what does that mean? God, I mean, I need the guy. Like, I'm, I guess I'm, I don't have the, the executive program or something. <laughs> uh -huh. Ooh. Alright, here we go. Keep a little point in the feet. I think I need to be on the barrel a little bit more. You want yourself up? Okay, there we go. Oh yeah, that's it. Okay. Better? Alright, now which way? Okay, so we're gonna do froggy. So the heels together, toes apart, bend the knees out to the side. Okay. Good. As you push away, don't let this dome out. Yep. Draw it in. Draw it in first, so that way when you're moving. Yeah. Woo! <laughs> It's hard to keep those legs going at the yeah. same rate. <laughs> See the spring in Oh, yeah. Ooh. All your stabilizers are trying to fix it. Ooh. All right, so legs come up towards the ceiling, nice and straight. Let's keep that with heels together, toes apart, and bring the legs okay. down. Don't let that dome out. Okay. Keep it down. Yeah. 
That was much better, because that's what protects the low back. And a hard tap, so tap keep my low back and abs engaged. Give me a big exhale when we get ready to throw those legs right in. Under, okay, guess what's right in there. Yeah. I've been hanging with Dr. Cooper. You saw me do about, I don't know, 45 minutes or so. Oh man, more longer than that. Yeah. Uh, got a little Pilates in today. I appreciate y'all hanging out. I'm gonna do a little stretch here real quick, and then I'm gonna let you all go. Hey, check it out, do me a favor. Go check out my podcast, Hanging With Dr. Cooper. We're on Apple, uh, Spotify. Uh, you can see this video as well as other stuff. And uh, do four things for me. Like, subscribe, download, and share. Like, subscribe, download, and share with your friends. Uh, I try to just put out stuff that, you know, makes sense when it touches my heart. Uh, thank God I got a day job, and I don't necessarily have to make any money doing this, but try to put out information that's going to be helpful uh, for you all. And just let you guys in a little bit on what, hopefully, uh, uh, a heart surgeon, young fellow like me, is doing uh, from time to time, and just sharing a piece of my heart with you. So... I'm going to stretch it out, stay around for a little while longer if you want to, but again, check me out, Hang With Dr. Cooper now, Formalize the Podcast, Apple, Spotify, like, subscribe, download, share, like, subscribe, download, share, and uh, I'll see you in a few weeks. I'm going to bring Dr. Harefield back. Uh, we talked a little bit last time about ego. Uh, he's going to come back in a couple weeks, and we're going to talk about karma. Uh, everybody calls karma all kinds of bad things, but uh, what you don't realize is that you create karma. Uh, karma is not a bad thing. It's all about you, and that's what I've learned in the last eight months or so that I've been mentored and advised and coached uh, by Dr. my spiritual advisor, Dr. Uh, Hareful Field. And then um, uh, September, we're going to start another series with my good friend, uh, Dr. LaSonia Roberts-Lopez. You can find her on Instagram at shift, S-H-Y-F-T-U, shift, U, uh, Dr. LaSonia Roberts-Lopez. She was a GYN oncologist in Atlanta. And we're going to do a whole series on women's health. It's coming up on the fall. And um, we're going to talk about some things that are relevant for women beyond uh, just breast cancer, okay? Dysperiunio, which is uh, painful uh, sexual intercourse, uh, all kinds of issues like that. Um, uh, yeah, it'll be fun. So uh, I'll be back. Stay with me for a little while longer. Finish this workout up. And uh, you hang with Dr. Cooper. Appreciate you. All right, here we go. Single leg stretching. Stretching. Got it. My single leg stretch. Uh, Christina knows I got real, 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 real tight hips. So everything that I do, if you notice in a workout, we're really trying to incorporate the core and the hips and everything. And really the hip tightness just comes from a very weak core in general. And it's not just abs, it's not about just you know, six pack. 
There's so much more to it than that. Ah, so I really try to get this thing stretched out as much as I can. And I try to really stretch it every day if I can. Ah, whoo, mercy. Here we go. Ah, welcome to your tour. Slalom. Ah. Uh. I want to do my little hip opening over there, Christina. Which one? On the uh, chair. Now open up and do the, oh, the uh, pigeon. Oh, the pigeon. pigeon, yeah. Ah. Uh. Uh. See, I'm trembling. It's a sound of weakness. I'm not the muscles. It's actually the muscles. So let's go all the way over. Yeah, so support the femur okay. on the top of the box. And then the hips can rest. Oh. So the other thing we're going to do is square off that hip. Ah. I need that hip. Woo! Even with the other one. So I'm trying to do a little modified pigeon because I can't do a real pigeon yet. But I'm working on it. Hey, at least I'm trying. You know? Ah. 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 Woo! That feels good. That feels real good. Kansas City, or if you got like that, you can travel. Uh, come to see Christina. Uh. Says, say, do your best, but get the rest. Hey, Coop out. Y'all have a good one. Check me out again. Apple Podcast, Spotify, TikTok, Hip Hop, whatever you want to do. All right. Hey, love you. Y'all take care. Have a fantastic day. I'm out. <laughs>